All right, hey guys. Hi. So it's me, Maddie, and my lovely host, Tina. Tina. So today we're doing something a little bit different, different. than yeah. what we usually do. So what do we have here? Tina? So this is a small box from mangasnack.com. Um, we were lovingly sent this uh, to try it out. If you guys want to order your own, and they actually have three different sizes. They have a small, I think medium and large, and they also sell stickers and like a competo surprise. Um, you can go to mangasnack.com and put in our promo code MINT20 to get 20% off your item. So we're going to open this up and see what kind of snacks we get so we can enjoy some anime and snacks. So this is the small box. Right which contains, I guess we'll see what the usual amount is. It's supposed to be eight guaranteed snacks. So let's see. Oh, we got oh, stickers too. Stickers. <gasps> oh, look. Okay, so we have a little like Totoro. Steampunk. It, no, it's a little Bimo. Oh, oh. Bimo, right? Oh my God. <laughs> BB-8. BB-8. <laughs> Wrong fandom. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> He and I still have to finish watching Star Wars. Oh, oh, oh Tower BB-8. This oh, oh. Ah, Cute. So there's some Pokemon stickers in here. Oh. Another Totoro. Totoro. That's my boy. It's a boy. Yep. Mangasnack.com. I like their cute little like rainbow onigiri on here. It's, That's it's really, really cute. It's really is a tanagram too. So it's made up of like shapes. I like it. Cute. All right. Oh, um, here's an overview of items in your box. So we've got Pocky, which is cookies and cream and strawberry. Oh, look, there's little Competto. Oh, those are really cute. And okay, now listen, listen. So um, <laughs> <laughs> I love Japanese snacks. I always go shopping for stuff all the time. Now listen, I love umai so much. So umai means delicious. In Japanese, and I don't even know like what they're technically... savory and sweet. Yeah. So I made the mistake. So when I'm expecting something sweet, like you have that time where you like bite into it, and it's not what you're expecting. So I got one of these in Japan, and I put it in, and of course my Japanese legibility is like next to none. And I put it in my mouth, and it was not sweet. It was very savory, and I was just like. Ugh. <laughs> so mice are great because they have a ton of different flavors. Um, I love these so much, and it's it, like they have the different like flavors at the top. So this one is like uh, it's corn something. <laughs> Do we have like the? Uh, let's see. Um, for umaibo, umaibo. Um, I was on umaibo. Um, okay. The following flavors: cheese, cinnamon, apple, shrimp, sugar rusk, teriyaki burger. And corn pottage. That's why I didn't know that. I was like, what? I was like, I, I read corn pottage. Is it like a porridge? porridge? Yeah, yeah, I yeah, like a porridge. Like, yeah, so we have this is the, the corn, corn pottage. pottage. Yeah. And then the sugar rusk and teriyaki burger. What else did we got? The cheese. This one's the apple, right? Yeah. And then that one is shrimp. the, well, it's every mayo, so yeah, it's shrimp, shrimp mayonnaise. mayonnaise. I might try that one. Okay, well, let's luckily we can split these up. So, should we try the Amiibo first? Why don't we try the Amiibo first? Maybe my second try at it might be a little bit better. Do All you right. think I should go for a dessert one, though? Hey, I think we should go one by one. All right. We split them up, we try them. We try them. Let's go okay. all in. All right, we're gonna try this. Oh my goodness. Shrimp and mayonnaise, guys. It's really cute. I love Japanese mayo, though. <laughs> I hate American mayonnaise, but Japanese mayo I'm all about. It definitely smells. Oh, wow. These are messy. <laughs> I don't think you can tell. It's very shrimpy. <laughs> I like the mayonnaise taste to it. The shrimp, it's okay. It reminds me of like freshness burger, like the shrimp burger with some mayonnaise. Oh, it does. Yeah. Freshness burger is like a, it's a Japanese burger chain. Chain, not train. <laughs> All right. It's not bad. Mm -mm. I mean, honestly, very spot on. It is. It's, it's very shrimp and mayonnaise. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that sounds like it'd be gross, but it's actually like kind of like a soup, seafood like salad. You know, I like it's, it. It's really, really, really good, actually. All right. So moving on, this is the, what, apple cinnamon? Yeah, apple cinnamon. 
Okay, Tina, so we should be able to get your suite. Oh, I like this. They actually um, list, like, if you have allergies, so it, it tells you, like, um, please research the ingredients before consuming, and then it gives you, uh -huh. like, a list of what's actually in them. That's nice. So in case you have allergies, so that's, that's really, really nice. They also color-coded the Umaibo so you oh, know yeah, which like, one is which. So that's you, very nice. Which, which is pretty, pretty close to the package. You see the shrimp and the mayonnaise and... Okay. Mmm, that's good. All right, yeah. That's really spot on. That's really apple pie. That's why I love you, my boat. I don't know what kind of like sorcery they work to make everything taste exactly like what it is. That's really good. Like it, it really <laughs> tastes like fresh apple pie. Like, like besides not being warm, it yeah. really does. I hope nobody's bothered that we just buy it after each other. Oh, and I'm just not how bothered. close our friendship is. <laughs> Story time. She and I went to Japan together twice, <laughs> and we've gone to the onsen together. So if you're wondering about the onsen, <laughs> we've, seen we've, we've been very close to each other. Very close. Okay, so here's the cheese. That's gonna get some comments, I'm sure. I absolutely. You, after you. Okay, so the cheese. Yeah. I like how they they do like the little mascot guys. Really well, it's, cute. It's, it like Doraemon usually. Yeah, does. it looks like Doraemon. Uh huh. Is it like a Cheeto? No, it's a different type of cheese. So <laughs> Japanese it's, cheese. It's like a Cheeto, but not. But it might be because mm. we're following it after an apple. Mm hmm There's something something extra with it. Do you taste that? Yeah, I don't know how to I know it's cheese. But I couldn't tell you like It's a which creamy cheese. cheese. Yeah. It's like a Yeah, like a like a mac and cheese. Yeah. Yeah, it's more of a mac and cheese. Like, mac. like it's kind of like if you made mac and cheese with a Cheeto. Yeah. <laughs> also, this I love this, but it's actually they will good. stick to your teeth. Yeah. So like, I got a whole mess in here, but it's worth it. Okay. Well, I mean, it, it's like it's like a corn puff. What's what? sugar rush? Yeah. I have no idea. Sugar rush. I don't even know. What is that I'm supposed brave. to mean? I don't know what a sugar rush is. What? Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one doesn't have a hole in it. Churro, but not churro. What's it like? I really like it. So normally they have a hole in the middle. This one doesn't. And it's like it's coated in sugar. Like it tastes like a sugary like donut or something, but not a sugary donut. Like a, a fried something. Like a sugary fried something. Like a fritter type, but not like mm -hmm. an apple fritter. It's like um, I know what you mean. It's like a fair food. Yeah. But yeah. a light, like not greasy fair food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's actually really, really good. I like it. And you can find a these plus. guys like in little like claw machines. Like mm -hmm. when you can play for them and stuff and get a whole bunch. Like I got a whole bunch and then I was like, yeah, I, I've been to the first one. It wasn't what I expected because I was expecting candy and I was like, it's safe for me. And you can find this at most Japanese supermarkets, even mm -hmm. the small ones, because Umaibo is really cheap. Super cheap. Yeah, in Japan you just buy these huge, 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 huge bags of Umaibo of all different flavors. Um, so you can find those everybody, everywhere. Alright, so we have Teriyaki Baga. I'm interested in this one. Teriyaki Burger. I'm a little terrified. Yeah. You know what? That'd be good. Burger right. flavored snacks. Milady. Oh, after me, right? No, you're taking turns. Oh. Okay, so I, I, you know those like little kits, the candy kits? Yeah. So I made one, and it was a savory one. Worst experience of my life. And it was a teriyaki flavored one. And so now I'm like dubious about candy that's like teriyaki something. I was really glad that they sent us this stuff instead of those candy kits because they, those scare me so much. Oh, <laughs> it's very teriyaki. It's not my thing. That's why I took like this much of a bite. It does. It does taste like a very I, vinegar, vinegar yeah, like. I would go out of my way for that one. It does taste like a teriyaki burger, but I would rather eat a teriyaki burger than eat a sumo. But you know what? It might be your thing. It was an experience, but not like an awful one. It's okay. No, it's it's not bad. Like I'm just like broken on teriyaki since that. Since the incident. Since the incident. 
All right, so now we have the corn pottage. What is pottage? I don't know. Porridge? The soup? The porridge? That... There's like a little like corn in here hanging out in like a pot of it's water. Be, is it like a cream corn? Mm, I don't know. Somebody tell us what a pottage is. Like, do you make it in like a crock pot? Do you make it in like... It smells good. Smell it. <laughs> Oh, it's just like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, oh, it, it's like I just put corn in my mouth. Mm. I love it. I love Japanese corn stuff though, <laughs> because like in Japan you can just buy like pizza with corn. Like I'm so I tired of pizza corn. corn, corn on everything, mm -hmm. corn on salads. No. no, I love corn. corn on pizza, corn on hamburgers, corn soup. It's awesome. You just get warm, like a can of can warm corn soup. <laughs> Listen, it's corn on sushi. Hey, you thought you were rid of corn? Guess what? Have some more corn. Have, Have some, some corn on your corn. Put some corn on your corn. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay. So all right. Let's give our final umaibo rankings. Oh, rankings? Okay. Well, not rankings, but just like, what, what did you? We had six different flavors, right? The apple one was my was your favorite. favorite. Yeah. Uh, second one to that is probably going to be probably the cheese and then the shrimp. Yeah. And then the sugar and then the corn. <laughs> and there we go. All right. Yes, yeah, so I think, yeah, I, I agree. I really like the cinnamon apple. I like mm -hmm. the sugar rusk. Um, the cheese I could, I could do without. I love the ebi mayo, mm -hmm. the shrimp mayo. I love that. And I love the corn one. Okay. And teriyaki, I'm not a big fan of. And that's okay. But that's fine. It, it's somebody's cup of tea. It's mm -hmm. not, not ours. Yeah. All right. So this is a milk ita. <laughs> milk ita. So chocolate, chocolate shake candy. candy. Do, do, do. Are they, it's like a little, they've got little squares on the picture, but they're actually kind of oval. It looks kind of like a taffy. A little like a taffy. Is it chewable? Mm-hmm. It's like a tissue roll. Yeah. That was my doll. This is where we fast forward. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing this for Sorry, it's really hard. My doll like popped. <laughs> it's like a, um, kind of like a more milky Tootsie Roll. Mm -hmm. More tastes like actual chocolate Tootsie Roll. Mm hmm. No. It's not bad. It's just like a chewy chocolate milky taste. Competo. Yeah. Pretty self-explanatory. Do you want the green, blue? I want the pink, pink one. Okay. These are so cute. They are. So um, let's explain to everyone what Competo is. That's like, so if you've ever watched like your older animes and stuff or even like in Bleach, like when the kids in the other world, like they're, they're eating little Competo sugars and they're having yeah. them. So it's just basically like rock candy, like sugar rock candy, but it's the Japanese version essentially. And it said, um, it's a collection of colorful sugar candies that can be enjoyed by themselves or with a nice cup of tea. Aww. So I guess you flavor your tea with them? Yeah, because like this is, uh, they had them in Spirited Away mm -hmm. with the little sit sprites and we carry them. I always love these. And it's just your little rock candy. And stuff. I was, I mean, we have a, like, just like a stick of raw candy. Mm-hmm. I like these. It's just sugar. Mm -hmm. But it's so cute. I think that's the other thing, too. It's just, it's not that just that it's, like, tasty and mm -hmm. sweet. But it's just, it's very, like, it's very aesthetic. <laughs> well, it is. I mean, it, it's different. Like, it's just little granules of sugar. But the different colors are really cute. And you can mm -hmm. see why this, like... Like, I've done a tea ceremony before in Japan, like a, a more informal one, and we had confetto okay. with it. And then we all know about Pocky. So overall, good. So we've got, one, 14 items with it. Oh my gosh, with Pocky. Mm. Because we know it. It's very classic in, like, anime fan communities now, I think. You yeah. Know, like, if you, like, like anime or you like Japanese stuff at all, Pocky has pretty much kind of made its way into America in recent years. Oh, absolutely. I remember when this first dropped in... 
Like Walmart's? Oh yeah, in the international ago? section, like I would go to Meyer. I don't I don't know if everybody has Meyers, but they had an international section that actually had Japanese food before like Walmart and stuff and I'd yeah. go there and be like, they have Pocky. And we would just go or you would have to go to the Japanese market. My dad would always pick them up from Walmart. Even when like we lived in different cities and he would send boxes to me. Aw, that's cute. I love cookies and cream. So yeah, Pocky, for our viewers at home that don't know, they're little biscuit sticks. Now I say biscuits and more like cookie biscuit. Um, now these are kind of stuck together, but they're like a long, oh no. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> well anyways, they're a long like biscuit stick and they're usually like covered in like a cream. They make these in all sorts of like flavors. So chocolate, uh, cookies and cream like we have, strawberry. Um, yeah. And like, they have like they big have, like, pocky, almond. small pocky, banana, everything. Yeah. It's such a big booming business. And you see people play like the pocky game all the time, which is like, the, like Lady the, and the Tramp, but Pocky. In you your know? mouth and like going and I don't know. Yeah. So yeah, overall. How so? Oh. <laughs> we gotta eat go. it. Go. Oh, no, I think this is a really good selection. Like, Stupid. we're lucky we know some about some of this stuff since we've been to Japan, but I think for a lot of people that don't. This might be their first try. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And especially if you don't have a Japanese market in your area, we're really lucky to have that. Mm-hmm. You know, I think this is a great gift. If you have a friend that's into Japanese culture and like would like to know more about Japanese snacks and stuff, this is such a cute thing to get people. And honestly, I could see like with the box, if we took this up out of the box ahead of time, it made mm -hmm. a little cute little bouquet <laughs> of my <umaibo. laughs> Right? Like, I think that'd be really cute. So if you like what you've seen, you want to try your own, remember to go to mankasnack.com, uh, put in promo code MINT20 to get 20% off, and enjoy. Uh, and if you like us doing videos like this, let us know. T and I are ha always happy to try more things like this. I know, right? Like, if you think I sh we should just go and get weird random Japanese things to eat, to try out as sort of like a companion piece to our anime videos, please let us know. Um, I will try most things. <laughs> She will. And also, um, don't forget to like this video. Um, comment down below what you think, you know, if you'd be interested in this or if you tried some of these foods before um, or if you have any questions about them, I guess. Uh, and also, don't forget that we ha we do a Patreon now, so if you're interested in supporting our channel and our endeavor to make more videos, uh, that's in the description below. And so check it out. Comment. Please, please subscribe. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. Strawberry ones are all.